Okay, here's my little uh, how-to on how to replace the starter on a 04 and up, 04 to 15 Armada, 05 and up Titan. Here's the parts I removed so far. Little cover. I guess I've got the intake manifold completely exposed. Looks like there's five bolts on each side. Bolting it down to the aluminum intake, or actually right under the head. So I've removed the outer body, a couple of outer bolts, left the hoses on. Disconnected the fuel rail with a sleepy little fuel removal tool. Somewhere around here. A couple of hammers needed and these long reach pliers made it real easy to get all the fuel lines, uh, fuel injectors disconnected. Get some better lighting here. Basically, I disconnected the PCB hoses on both sides, disconnected the tranny fill tube on this side. I've completely removed the EVAP the hose. I only had one casualty. This rose actually hose ripped right here, but I didn't want to break this nipple so I can replace the hose easy enough. So there's the fuel line up there. So I can actually see the first eight bolts. Just got to remove. I can't really see. One way back here. It looks like I can get to it. So, probably taking me 20 minutes or so to get this far. So now I'll just disconnect the plenum or intake. I guess it's really an intake manifold on these things. And then we'll pop it off and see if we can physically see the starter. Update here. I went ahead and took off this bracket. There's a couple of six millimeter bolts right there. Just get in with a 10 millimeter ratchet. Take out this monster chunk of steel to hold on. A little piece of plastic. So that'll give me a lot more access back there to those bolts. I've already popped off the front two bolts. Little, uh, I love using these little quarter inch ratchets. And just gonna. Oh, pop everything off. Try not to use anything big. Don't want to break anything. All right, to be continued. So I think this is a six inch extension. Just happens to be a deep socket. You get these little, uh, looks they're like a six millimeter bolt. You got a 10 millimeter head. You get these little intake bolts off. Seems like the best tool to use is this six inch extension. You can actually, oh, try to do the left handed, I'm right handed. I cannot see the bolt. Oh, there it is. I'll go to my right hand. Ooh. Oh, I got it. So, apparently you don't really need to see the bolt. I cannot see a thing back there, but it's actually to get that one it's off just pop the right off it's very easy to pop off had a lot more trouble with the aluminum ones there's all the gaskets i've actually tried to replace these on a v40 on my friend's four liter and uh the dealer didn't even stock them because they never replace them when they do this kind of stuff which is kind of scary but um I just disconnected the uh, brake booster hose before I popped the manifold loose. Just popped out right there, it was easy to get to. And that way I had nothing. I dropped one of the bolts down in here. Very bad. Make sure I don't do that later. So there's the starter. Pretty cool idea to put it there out of the way, but I have a lot of work to get to. He's nice and clean. I'm used to the VG motors where it's on the side of the block and it usually gets oil on it from changing the oil filter every three months. So pretty cool. I just disconnected the battery. 10 millimeters. So pretty much everything's a 10 millimeters. Only like two 8 millimeters. They're all 6 millimeter bolts. So you only need like two tools and an Allen or whatever that was and the stupid fuel line clip. 
bunch of long reach pliers and screwdrivers helpful. I've got a really bad thumb injury. I'm a smashed thumb, so I can't use my thumb much. Uh, but um, it's taken me half an hour or so. I'm not sure. Okay, had a little trouble getting these bolts loose. My starter look like they're 12 millimeter, 14 millimeter socket. So I, uh, I actually use an extension from the back. Typical like transmission bolt method. So I tried some different ways. It's actually jacked up the front. And used the breaker bar from down here. And there's my light up there. It worked really good. Okay, here's the tool I used. Two, two footers. Tool joint and a 14 millimeter socket. That was so much easier doing it from the bottom. I'm trying to do it from the top. Oh, I don't know why I even bothered wasting time to do it from the top. But I got the two bolts. They were very seized on once I cracked them loose with a two foot breaker bar. Uh, Bolt is broke loose, and now I can actually do these. Look at the doing my fingers now. I did spray a little PB blaster on them while I go, uh, but I could not get them with a cheater bar or anything from the top. Just didn't have the reach and strength. You can see I'm standing on a stool here just to try to reach lane on here. Thank God this is nice and smooth to lay on. Put all my weight on here. No, no horn, no hood junk poking me. Ah, I got all the bolts off, so almost halfway done. Okay, I got the new starter and the old one. Well, two old ones actually. I'm gonna do a little silly bench test uh, with a jump starter here. As you can see, the starter works fine when there's no load on it. Typical. Oh, I can't do this one handed. Anyway, the starter works fine. Let me test the replacement. I can see here this is the original 05 starter. According to Nissan Fast, it fits. There's the part number. It fits all Nissan Armadas 04 and up and Titans 04 to 15. You can see the part number there. It's like 7S1000, made by Mitsubishi. Uh, but you can see the replacement one is actually from like a 2008 or 7 or something like that off eBay. It's like 30 bucks, but you can see it's quite different. Uh, this is supposedly for a flex fuel. According to eBay, it doesn't fit, but I'm pretty sure it'll be fine. Maybe it's better. I don't know. You can see that they've changed the design quite a lot. The casting on the front is different for the bolts. See, there's no bolt here, but there's a bolt here. It looks like it's an internal bolt. This motor actually looks bigger than this one. So I don't know if this one's weaker. Uh-oh. So uh, we'll give it a shot. See if it fits.